Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, Vintage Baseball Card Packs. Today I'm going to take a break from opening up vintage baseball cards because new 2021 Tops just came out this week. Just a couple days ago, Tops 2021 Series 1 came out, and in a previous video, I showed you the blaster box of uh, 2021 Series 1. Today I'm going to open up a hanger box from Walmart. This hanger box has 67 cards and two exclusive Royal Blue base parallel cards. Um, I went to Walmart, a couple different Walmarts on Wednesday when on release day, and I couldn't find anything. But then when I got home, I checked Walmart online and I was able to order these hanger boxes online. So just at retail price, $11.98, and I actually got several of them. And two days later, here they are in the mail. Let's take a look at this one and let's see how a hanger box looks like from Walmart. Um, the cover is the same as like the blaster box. Um, and blaster box has a patch card. This doesn't have, does not have a patch card. And here's all the odds. If you can take a look and then the no purchase necessary information. Um, I haven't mailed this one in, but Previously, I've been mailing in, uh, I've mailed in about 20 or 30 in the last three or four months, and I've yet to receive any no purchase necessary cards back. It might be related to COVID, but I'm not sure. So maybe leave in the comments if you guys send send these in and have gotten anything back. I'd be curious to know. So, um, and that's about it for the outside of it. So let's open this up. And see what we get and I apologize when I go through these cards I'm not as familiar with the new rookies and all the new players and everything so if I miss a key key card forgive me and feel free to tell me in the comments so here's the pack of cards that's at the bottom nothing else so I think overall these cards do look pretty good and I look forward to opening up more and more packs. And I'm not sure about the layout of these, this whole hanger box, hanger pack. So we'll see where the good cards come. All right. And as a lot of people commented, it's pretty hard to read the players. So I'll just go through them quickly. So Seattle Mariners, yeah, Brandon Crawford, Crawford, Giants, Mets, um, yeah, it is very hard to read, uh, Rangers, Salvador Perez, Alberta Almara Jr., Cubs, Julio, Urias from the Dodgers, World Series champions. Braves. David Dahl. Indians. Orioles. I don't think we have an and San Diego team card. I don't think we've gotten any rookies yet, so and no special cards. Rays, Hunter Renfro, Griffin Canning, Miami Marlins team card, Tampa Bay team card. A lot of landscape cards in this set. Three team cards. Brewers, Juan Soto, league leaders. So I think that's our first best card. Brady Singer. Alice Verdugo, Patrick Sandoval, Miguel Rojas, Brewers, Blue Jays, Jack Flaherty, St. Louis, Jake DeGrom, Mets. Oh, here's a rainbow card. So our first parallel insert, rainbow, Jake DeGrom. So pretty good. And throughout the set, we have 1952 
retro cards, um, Yadier Molina. And the other interesting thing is they're on old stock also. So it they, they're very interesting. So they're nice that way too. So we get one of those, then a Jake DeGrom, 52, Verlander, 52, Sonny Gray, 52. So we got four of those. Mike Piazza, uh, 1986, because that's 35 years ago. The 35 year anniversary cards is 1986. So we got a Piazza. And then we got a, here's our blue parallels. Blue parallel, Adam Plutko. And Gio Gonzalez. And we got a nice insert here. Uh, Pete Alonso um, through the years. And then I think back to regular cards. But we haven't gotten any money rookies yet, so we'll see about that. Tampa Bay. Uh, Mar Marco Gonzalez. Wilson Ramos, Clayton Kershaw, World Series card, Guriel, Luis Robert, pretty good second year card with the uh, Topps Rookie Gold, Gold Cup, Francisco Lindor, Hernandez, Albert Pujols, um, Astros, Tigers, Charlie Blackman, Rockies, Indians, Eloy Jimenez, nice card. I'm a bit of a Sox fan these days, so happy with that. Chris Davis, Freddie Freeman, Rafael Devers. Marcelo Zuna, league leader card. Sonny Gray, Buck Farmer, uh, Garrett, the Reds, league leaders, Yankees, Roberto Perez, and now some rookies. Chris Bubick, Royals. Then we got um, Burroughs of the Tigers. Future Stars, Bo Bichette, second year card. Uh, Kansas City, J. Core. Ken Lario, Detroit. And uh, Ryan Castellini, Rockies. So nothing too spectacular in this hanger box. Um, but some of these rookies, you never know how they're going to turn out. And I like the blue parallels are nice. White Sox, Gio Gonzalez. I got two of those. We got an 86 card. We got four of the 52 retro cards. Sonny Gray, Verlander, Jake DeGrom, and Yadier, Yadier Molina. And we got a rainbow Jake DeGrom. And then we got a Juan Soto. So that's what a hanger box from Walmart looks like. So what was that again? 67 cards. And there we go. So I hope you enjoyed. And I hope you can find some hanger boxes at Walmart. It's always hard to find them there. So maybe check online, uh, see if they get back in stock that way, or somehow find them at Walmart. Um, and good luck to you and see where else you can find cards. So maybe if you want to share, post down, down below what type of stores you've had the best luck getting cards. I'm, Target does a little bit better because Target has been limiting purchases one or two or three per person. So they've been lasting a little bit longer there. So that's an idea. And that's about it. And if I get any other series one types of boxes, I'll do videos coming up on those. Otherwise, I'll be getting back to some vintage baseball card packs. I have Donruss, and hopefully I'll get some other tops also. So there you go. Uh, please like and please subscribe to the channel, and I will see you on the next video.